Good morning, YouTube. So with today's video, it's gonna be a sexy cheapy. That's gonna be from Calvin Klein, and that's gonna be Obsessed. Now this didn't really get a whole lot of talk about over the years, and it's not that old. It came out in 2017, class as an Amber Woody, but it's surprisingly quite good. Now the note breakdown for this one here, top notes are gonna be lemon, lavender, Szechuan pepper, grapefruit, and cardamom. The mid is gonna be cedar, leather, lavender, pineapple, and geranium, and the base is gonna be cinnamon, patchouli, amberwood, black vanilla husk, and broxen, and musk. Now I tried doing that without reading the notes, and that was just too much, no, no way. So what do I get from this one here? Now this opens up with citruses, warm spices, but also like a bit of, a, of an ambery feel. In the dry down, I'm looking for leather, but the leather doesn't even say hello. How rude is that, right? I was really hoping that there was gonna be a little leather to this one here, but citruses, warm spices, a little ambery, sweet from the vanilla, woody, but also musky towards the base, and you will get a little bit of ambrox. This was surprisingly, Good. I wasn't expecting much in all honesty. It's mass appealing, it's easy to wear, but it also leans a little young. Now, I'm 45, I'm not young, nor am I old. I'm just middle age, right? I like it. This is something that I would reach for. You know, if you're just like an everyday Joe, I think that you should look into it. It's actually quite good. It has a little sex appeal, a little flirtatiousness. It's quite playful. So when I'm thinking of occasions, I'm thinking night out. You know, nothing like club. But if you're going on a date, you know, whether it's like a, like a casual date, like mini putt in a dinner, you know, dinner in a movie, billiards, something like that, a walk on the beach, this is a good intimate scent. It's not a banger. Now, longevity is not that bad. Six, seven hours tops, anywhere, it ranges anywhere, in all honesty, five to seven hours, but I get about six to seven hours. Projection is not a monster. Siage, it's not fantastic. So if you're looking for like monstrous longevity and all that kind of stuff, then this is something that I don't think that you'll like. But for me, if I'm a single guy, I don't want something that's gonna be aggressive and abrasive. I don't want something that's gonna be in my date face. I'm, I'm trying to get to know this girl. If she smells this on you, she's gonna like it because she's gonna have to get more into your space. And that's what you want, is it not? Like you don't always want a fragrance that's going to do all the talking. You want your mannerisms, your wardrobe, your swag, your personality. That's what you want. You don't want a fragrance that's gonna slap your date around. It's like, hey, give me attention because she's gonna get turned off. But if you are just the right amount and this, she's gonna like it because it does have that sex appeal. Only bros overspray. I'm a bit of a bro. I could be an oversprayer. I think that four sprays at the most when it comes to this is all you need. I've done six sprays and it was a little heavy during that first hour, okay? Lesson learned. But only bros or insecure guys really overspray because they want the attention. They want the compliments. So there's a little bit of shade being thrown at some people out there. I don't care for compliments. If I get one, yes. But if I don't, my day's not ruined. I'm not gonna cry about it. I'm not gonna say, hey, this fragrance sucks because I didn't get any attention. I didn't get any compliments. But as I said, this is a night out scent. But I do think that you can wear it to school as well. Seasons, I would say spring, fall. Winter, maybe not so much because I don't really see this really cutting through like the dead of cold. Now, if you live in Canada, I live in Toronto where it can get quite cold. So people are probably gonna say, oh, there's a reason why you're an asshole. Well, yeah. Torontonians are the assholes of Canada, and I should know this because I serve them on a daily basis. So if you're visiting Toronto and you say, oh my God, Canadians are so friendly, what? But I'm a bus driver, so I view the world through a different set of eyes. Price tag is fantastic as well, $25 to $35. Would I recommend this fragrance? Absolutely. If you're looking for something that's playful and sexy, that might get you a few compliments, if it doesn't, don't let that ruin your day. Look into this one here. And the price tag, the performance, is really not that bad. Price tag is, you can't go wrong with this. Trust me. 
This deserves to get more attention in our community. And this would easily make a top 10 Calvin Klein video without question. So that is my very honest take of a Calvin Klein obsessed, but also a little bit of shade being thrown as well. If you like this video in the shade, leave me one of these. Any other videos that I've done from this brand, they will all be down in the description box below. And because of this is a sexy cheapie, why don't you check out this side here. Thank you for your time, take care, and I will see you later. Thanks for watching, everybody.